everybody and welcome back to Lushtopia where we talk about all things Lush. So today's video is going to be a Lush haul. Um, I wanted to get another shower gel that I will show you. Um, so I just decided to place a, an order for a couple of items. So if you want to see what I got then you can just keep on watching. So the first thing we'll talk about is the main reason why I placed my order and it is a shower gel and it is snow cake shower gel. I've already got one of these um, but as soon as I got my order of the community favourites um, I decided that I would definitely want to pick up another one of these before they went out of stock or they were unavailable anymore so I decided to go ahead and pick up another one of these because both me and my sister love the snow cake scent. So this was £12 for this bottle and here there is um, almond milk, cassie absolute, rose absolute and benzon resinoid. So it is a beautiful um, creamy almondy marzipan scent and it's just absolutely delicious. Especially for this time of year and Lush always fill their shower gels right to the very brim. So that's always great. Um, but yeah, it's just a very very nice um, relaxing scent. It is very very moisturising as well. The little description on the front says marzipan scented lathers are the stuff dreams are made of. Moorish almond, rose and benzoin making make showering a piece of cake. So it's very very nice and I highly recommend if you're going to pick up anything from Lush on the internet anytime soon that you maybe think about picking up some snow cake because it's absolutely delicious. The next thing that I got was actually recommended to me by one of my lovely subscribers. She's actually kind of class her as a friend now. Um, her name is Penny Norris and on YouTube she goes by the name Cheeky Monkey 6 So if you ever see her comment and give her a big thumbs up on her comment because she's a lovely, lovely lady and she likes to check in on me now and again. But this was recommended to me by her um, in my last I think it was my empties video, I was talking about how I needed to get a moisturiser, if you would recommend any moisturisers to me and whatnot, and she recommended banana skin. So I picked up some banana skin, this is £10, it is like a, an oil, a facial oil, oops nearly dropped it, um, and it just smells really really nice really like it. I like to use this at night time. I've used it twice already because I've actually had all of this um, sitting with me for just about a week so it's been really really hard not to use any of this um, but with this I had to try it out because it was just absolutely amazing. So again £10 in here there is a long list of ingredients. Maru Maru butter, organic lipe butter, fresh banana, organic cold pressed grapeseed oil, Capuccio butter, mango butter, banana peel, apricot kernel oil, organic jojoba oil, sandalwood oil, labdamum resinoid, abarete seed oil, tonka absolute, gardenia extract and safflower petal extract. So it's very very good. So what you basically do is you can warm it between your fingers and rub it on your face or you can just take it directly to your face, rub it on, rub it into your skin and then leave it to sit. Um, but I did find with this, it doesn't leave like an oily finish, which is good because I have acne prone skin. Anything oily kind of upsets that. This kind of leaves like a, it's hard to explain, like a kind of powdery finish, almost like a kind of mattifying finish. So it's really, really good. I really like it so far. Um, if you want me to get back to these in a couple of weeks, let like you know how this gets on with acne prone skin, I could definitely do that. But yeah, this is the second thing that I picked up and another reason for me even doing a haul on the Lush website. Mm. The next thing I got is a bath bomb and I always seem to pick this up every now and again because it's just one of my absolute favourites. It is the Olive Branch Bath Bomb. This is £3.95. So if you ever hear me talking about Pansy, um, the Pansy fragrance, this has the same fragrance as that. And it's just this lovely kind of summery, Fruity, flowery, beautiful scent, absolutely adore this. In here there is bergamot oil, lemon oil, orange flower absolute, Sicilian red mandarin oil and fair trade olive oil. So it is a very, very moisturising bath bomb as well. I've used this a lot um, and it leaves the water like a kind of orange cloudy colour. It's just absolutely delicious looking. 
and I highly, highly recommend this one um, if you haven't tried it yet and you've loved the olive branch scent family. This is an absolute great bath bomb. Um, I always love having one of these in my collection. Absolutely love it. Next thing I got is something that I've not had for a while and when I was just looking through the bath bomb section on the Lush UK website I seen it and I thought I'm going to pick one of them up because it's just a lovely little one to have around really and he is Echo Baby Bot and he's just this beautiful, that's another bath bomb that's rubbed off on him um, he's a beautiful kind of lavender fragrance, he was only £2.50 and and he basically just smells like lavender and chamomile and he's just absolutely beautiful. This was originally designed for children I believe um, but I love it. Um, I know a lot of adults that can use this. It's very very gentle on the skin and it's just really really nice. So basically this is a very very basic bath bomb. So all that is in here la, uh, fragrance wise is lavender oil, Australian sandalwood oil and chamomile blue. So yeah, I've not had him for a wee while and I just thought he's very, very cute. So why not pick him up again and we can have a little bath. So with a nice cozy bath with some lavender. So yeah, I picked him up because he's beautiful and I love lavender. The next one I picked up again is one of my absolute favourite bath bombs of all time and it is called Shoot for the Stars. And this is a Christmas bath bomb but it's in the Honey I Wash the Kids fragrance. Mm, and see um, when they've done the big release of all the bath bombs there is a Honey I Wash the Kids bath bomb and it's yellow with orange dots I prefer this one even though it's the same scent there's just something about having a glittery dark blue bath with little gold stars floating about in the winter absolutely beautiful so this was £4.95 and in here there is fair trade organic cocoa butter Brazilian orange oil, bergamot oil, cream of tartar, gardenia extract creamed coconut and almond oil and this is a very very luxurious bath when you use this this part's all a bath bomb but the little gold stars are actually bath melts and you get three of them so when they pop out of the bath bomb they kind of float about the top of your bath and they just make it a very very nice moisturising bath so I really really love that one and again it's one of my absolute favourite scents from Lush I've actually got um, Lush dupe wax melts um, in this fragrance so my full house can smell like that. Next we have a bath bomb that my sister used before I could review it because it's her favourite scent and it is called Rudolph and he is £3.95 but look at how cute he is with his little paper ears. These can actually be used as name tags for Christmas if you would like to recycle them. That is um, what they are there for. But this has the snow cake scent, so this and this have the same scent. Um, but I got this last time and my sister was going to go for a bath, so I decided to give this to her because it's one of our favourite scent families. But I picked it up again so I could do like a wee review of it and put pictures of it on my Instagram and things like that. So the last thing that I got is strawberries and cream bath bomb which again is £3.95. This is in the Yummy 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 or Yummy Mummy fragrance um, scent family. If you've seen my um, last Lush haul, the Roller bath bomb has the same scent as this, but I prefer this because it's got the little butter bit in the middle and it's just it's just lovely. It's absolutely beautiful and I've not purchased, uh, purchased this one for a wee while now, so I thought I'd get another one of them. So in here there is Fair Trade Organic Cocoa Butter, Olabamum Oil, Bergamot Oil, Geranium Oil, Black Pepper Oil, Strawberry Powder and Fair Trade Shea Butter. And I did notice in the Roller Bath Bomb that I didn't have the Black Pepper Oil. Hello. Okay, I'm back. So I was actually on the phone for a little bit there, so please excuse that. But as I was saying, I don't think the Roller Bath Bomb had the Black Pepper in it. So I feel like the strawberries and cream bath bomb has a little bit more of a, I don't know, like a spicy scent to it, which I really, really like. So that's why I picked up some more of the strawberries and cream. As you guys probably know, is I do have a little obsession with that bath bomb. And I've not had it for a couple of weeks. So I thought I'd pick that up and yeah, that's why I got that one. 
But that is all for this week's Lush haul. I really hope that you've enjoyed. Um, I was also thinking, I would really like if you guys would leave in the comment section down below your favourite Lush products and then maybe I can pick a few of them and order them for myself and see my thoughts and opinions on them. So if you have a product or whatever from Lush that you really, really, really like, leave it in the comments down below and then maybe, you never know, the next Lush haul that I do might have your favourite product in it. So I'd really, really appreciate that. Yeah, that is it for this video, guys. Really hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you in my next one.